to welcome everybody to what is probably going to be one of my final uh, recording sessions of the year. As you can see, we're back here in Spyro. Um, I'm probably going to finish the game. At least uh, the goal is to 100% it or get close, um, although I'd like to 100% it tonight. Um, and excuse me as I readjust my mic here. Uh, I'd like to 100% it tonight so that way later on I don't have to... Um, you know, I don't want to be rushing on the last day of the year to try and 100% this game. In fact, I, I'm not even sure. I might want to do an end-of-the-year special. I still need to do my verdict on uh, Assassin's Creed 4, you know, stuff like that. So really, my the, the, my goal is to basically be done with this game today. Uh, you know, not saying, you know, that, hey, I want to rush it. Well, I am trying to rush it, but, you know, not saying that, hey, I don't want to enjoy it. Because obviously, you know, this game is just so fun anyway to me. But... At the same time, you know, I got to move on, got to go to better stuff. I got some games I missed earlier this year that I got to uh, come back to and complete. I got a lot of stuff to do, really. And uh, the only thing I'm going to ask you to forgive me for before we even start, and I'm trying to do it right now, is what I am actually doing is because it's like the end of the year, it's kind of crunch time for me. So um, I'm trying to render out as many episodes of Spyro as I can. So every like 10 or so minutes, you're going to have to forgive me because it only does take a little bit of time for, uh, for Spyro to render since it is an older game. That is way too loud. Hold on. There you go. Since it only does take a little bit of time for me to render Spyro, I'm going to be stopping every now and then to uh, load up another 15 minutes to put into the, the plug and chugger or the renderer. So we're going to do Dark Passage first. At least maybe after every level would be a good uh, a good measure of when to do it. Alright, so now is there anything back here? Ooh, ooh, ooh. No, there isn't. Okay. So now if you remember this level, this is the level that has the little puppies and the tortoises. Well, as you can see, the fool... ...basically changes the light. And I hate that. Sometimes they do that. They just immediately hit you. Which really isn't cool, but they do it. So basically, they change with the light, they become more vicious, so... The little puppies are nothing, it's just the big tortoises. Kinda have to do that. I know I just flamed it, that was a, a mistake on my part. Would not have been good if uh, they decided to hit me back. So now, I do not remember how to get to the other side. I remember I figured it out, but I don't remember how. The enemies here can be quite frightening. But you said watch the fools. I'd rather flame the fools. Yes, they're letting you know. Flame the fools. Oh, here we go. Here's the Cupid's archers, or whatever you want to call them. They have some weird enemies in this game when you think about it. And actually, I just made a mistake. I should have turned my turtle light off. Oops. I was going to be doing that the whole time. Alright, let's keep moving then. Blame the fool. See, so he was about to strike me through the fool. I'll try to bite you, I think. Bad puppy. What is this tur turtle gonna do? But be careful. I don't know. Oh, they revert? Oh, okay. I, I thought they stayed that way. They revert. Cool. What the? That made no sense. <laughs> Gee, thanks, dog. Azizi. Thank you for release. Oh, come on, go away. Uh, they a lot of times look. Even throws you off the step. They just don't say anything useful. Kind of lame, if you ask me. Oh shit, ooh! Vicious little puppies. And turtles. Look at that, I hate that! I don't know why they do it. Look, so quickly! I'm gonna go back and get some health before I progress. They do that so quickly. I personally think that's a little bit too quick, but oh well, you know, we're at the end of the game. Maybe it wasn't intentional. Oh, you can charge them too. Maybe they're maybe you're supposed to roll. Ugh. That's right. There is rolling in this game, and I never use it. Uh 
Oh, I remember the secret is, I believe, down here. Yeah, you can see there's a secret passageway. Yep. You're supposed to hear that sparkle and miss the jump intentionally. I remember now. I think this might take you to the back way as well. I don't know. All right, but first, let's go back. Oh, no, that's just a way out. Okay. Let's keep going. I know there's a lot of different places here in Dark Passage, so it's kind of confusing. Oop. There you go. See, look, it all came full circle. So now watch, you can get down here. Charge through the puppies. <laughs> Charge through all four of them. And, uh... Does this fool ever light up? I don't think he does. Yeah, basically have some balls right there. And not get destroyed by the fool. Or, uh, not the fool, the turtle. He bites. Oh, there's a coffin here too. I didn't even know. Free one up. Oh come on, it hit me on my bottom. That's lame. That was a free hit. I have no clue where that takes me. Uh. Oh, that's that's how I got up here. Okay. Apara. Thanks, Spyro. I'd love to help you catch Nasty, but I'd really hate being trapped in Crystal again. Don't worry. The only one who's gonna be trapped is him. I don't know, I guess there's, that's probably why they never help. Pretty lame excuse if you ask me. <laughs> there's only what, like, you know, 70 of you guys? You're telling me 70 bum-rushing dragons can't stop Nasty Nord? You guys are just lazy. on an island with these puppies. There we go. Obasi. What weird names. Thank you for releasing me. I'll get back in that pedestal. Alright, let me save since I've done all this work. Be a real shame if I were to, you know, die or lose it. Alright, so I'm at 340. So now all I gotta do is go back and finish the level normally. Oh no, look, there's still more exclusive stuff. Yeah, most of the treasure in this level, I remember. It's, uh, it's on the si uh, side passageway. If you don't do it, you won't get it. Me too. <laughs> I hate them. He is really going nuts. Eee, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's fine. Take the hit. There you go, and you need this firecracker for the chest over there. Yep, there you go. See it disappear. That was very weird. It's too far away. Got him. Oh, come on! 
I didn't see that stupid, whatever you want to call this thing. Stupid dog, I didn't see him. Jeez, I could die. Shit. Oof. I got him. Alright, this might be all the treasure. Yep. Excellent. There's no eggs in uh, the last couple of levels. I don't know why they didn't scale it out. There are none. All right, there we go. Perfect. There are no eggs in the the Dreamweavers or the Beastmaker worlds. I guess they got tired of programming thieves, so they stuffed them. They stuffed them all into a. Uh... Oh great, I fucked up something. They stuffed them all into the first three worlds. I don't know why. Seems pretty weird to me. Alright, Lofty Castle is right here, right? Okay, now this level is confusing no matter how you slice it, because it's like multiple levels. So actually what I'm going to do is, is very dumb of me. I'm going to stop here for a little bit. When I come back, I'm going to keep playing. Uh, just really quick, let me take care of stuff. Let me turn off my turtle light, because if I flip it off now... It'll, uh, it'll screw with the HD PVR, and I don't want that, so I'll be right back.